What's up guys, it's Kojak and today I'm going to show you how to double or dupe one of the cars that you own. Now I can't do it with the LG so I will do it with the fuselage and I started in my garage just so you guys can see that I only have two cars. That's all I own and I'm going to show you that this works and we're going to be able to sell one off for complete profit. So first thing we're going to need to do is go to my secret little spot. Partly because when you call the mechanic you have to make sure that the mechanic cannot find you when he brings you a car because there's a step in between calling him and getting your car. What is going on here? Hey lady, watch how to drive. And then I hit a pole. But there's a part in between calling your mechanic and getting your car that you have to do very quickly and it's very important. So we're going to go to my secret little spot and the first step to this when you get there is you have to have the cops impound your car. So the cops are going to kill you but so make sure that when you do this the car that you want to double is the car you're driving to this spot right here and I'll show it to you on the map it's that little curve and if you live in this big apartment up top here at the top of the hill it's gonna be very quick and very easy for you to access this point so first thing we're gonna need to do is kill these people who are usually always here and get the cops on us and then we're gonna need the cops to kill us and impound our car now you can see at the top, your personal vehicle has been impounded by the cops. So we did not spawn where we died and where we parked, so we need to get back there because that's the important part. Where those two people stand, there's a wooden gate. You need to jump that wooden gate and it's like a little strip to the backyard. So you need to get in there so your mechanic cannot find you. And before I do the next couple steps, I'll tell you what they are really quick so you can watch me do them. and. Otherwise, I don't think I'll be able to tell you and do them at the same time quick enough. So, come all the way back here, and what you're going to want to do is call your mechanic. And the only car I have in my garage is the LG, so that's the one I'm going to request my mechanic to bring me. Right when he comes to bring it to you, you need to quickly back out, hold the back button, and go down to request your personal vehicle and start spamming it. Just hit A as many times as you can before he gets there. When done correctly, remember our fusillade is impounded. That will be the car he brings us. So let's make sure that we can uh, do this the right way first. So everything works out. Call our mechanic. You need something? Huh? Only car I have right? available is the LG. Our fusillade is impounded. So we're gonna request that. Hold back. And now you can see that when I spammed request your car, look what he brought me. Didn't we just get this impounded? So now we're going to get in and we're going to head back to our garage. But before you get to your garage, you need to call the insurance company. So we'll call them right now as we're on the way back to our garage. MMI. We See, expect the unexpected. now that I've called them, the fuselade is an option to make a claim on. I'll look into it. Your replacement vehicle can be found in your garage. So let's head back to our garage to make sure that it is there. Okay, we will pull into the garage with our fuselade that we got from our mechanic by doing the little glitch. Now, we're pulling in right now, and there we go. It's the two cars that we started with, the LG and the Fusillade that we grabbed. And what's that? Another Fusillade. So let's get in this one and head to Customs and make sure that we can sell it for a profit. All right, now that we are at LS Customs, we should be able to sell this car. Also, I want to point out that this should work with any car that has the sell feature. And I had to come to this one. It's not the closest one to my house, but... The other two were saying they didn't need any cars, so hopefully this one will. And I do have the, the sell option. So let's see here. Sell it for $63,762. Sell vehicle. Are you sure you want to sell it? Yes, I am. All right, vehicle is now sold. And you can see that I have 63000 almost 64000 on me, and the 230 
seven thousand I had before I started, but I had to st spend some for the insurance company to get my car back. So we are just going to steal a car now, and I will drive you over to the garage and show you that, in fact, the two cars we started with are still in there, and I just got the money. Away we go, and we're off. And we are home, and we want to make sure we don't drive this car into our garage. I do not want that piece of crap. So we're going to run into our garage here, and when we get in, we should find two cars there. And there we go, the two cars I started with, right there and right there. And just to make sure that you know that I'm not talking over an earlier clip or anything, go over here, and there's the money, the 63000 almost 64 and the 236000 that I had when I left Customs prior to coming back here. So I'm really glad that I could show you guys that this works, and I think as long as you can get to the closest... LS Customs and you live in this apartment is definitely the fastest way to do it. Unfortunately, I wish I had an adder so I got more money doing this. But for those of you who do, you'll get a good chunk of change every time you sell one of those. And it should be pretty quick. So I hope you helped you guys out. And if you like this video, make sure you go ahead and hit that thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you want to have fun with us on GTA 5. Uh, the link in the description to my Twitch, go ahead and follow me on Twitch and it'll notify you whenever I start to live stream and you can come in and I'm on Xbox, Gamer Tags, just same as my YouTube, same as my Twitch and you can have fun with me and a bunch of friends. So I'll talk to you guys later. Remember, I'm Kojak. I'm out.